It is Monday, December 2nd, 2024, and this is the latest news update for Medellin, Colombia and Colombia as a whole. I believe I have seven good stories, so stay till the end with me. Let's jump into the first one right away. In live music news, Medellin cements its status as Colombia's electronic music hub with the Medellin Techno Festival featuring a week-long celebration of music, education, and culture. Organized by DJ Duro and the Intelligent Division Collective, the festival includes educational workshops, public performances, and a series of parties showcasing local and international talent. The event highlights the city's vibrant electronic music scene and its commitment to community and cultural growth. Okay, in currency news, in a major bust, the Traffic and Transportation Police of Antioquia seized 300 million in counterfeit bills from a public bus traveling from Bogota to Medellin. Discovered during a routine inspection, the fake bills were intended for distribution in Medellin during the Christmas season. The counterfeit money included 50,000 and 100,000 denominations. No arrests were made, but authorities are urging merchants and buyers to be vigilant. This operation is part of broader efforts to combat currency counterfeiting and protect the local economy. In Colombia history news, Colombia remembers Avianca plane attack 35 years later. On November 27, 1989, Pablo Escobar's Medellin cartel bombed Avianca Flight 203, killing 110 people. The attack aimed at a presidential candidate, Cesar Javeria, marked a brutal escalation in Escobar's war against the Colombian state. Despite increased efforts to combat the cartel, the bombing highlighted the severe security crisis and left a lasting impact on Colombia. Families of the victims continue to criticize the justice system's response, while the legacy of violence and drug trafficking persist in the country. Okay, in local business news, Exito Group is advancing its plan to unify all its stores under the Exito and Corullo brands. By September, 24 locations had been converted with a goal of 30 by the end of the year. The first Exito store was converted to Corullo at Gran Via with a $5.5 billion investment. The plan announced in May aims to simplify brand structures, increase sales, and improve cost efficiency. Over 150 more stores will be converted over the next four years. Despite a 2.2% increase in operating income in Q3 2024, the company reported a loss due to challenges in Argentina. Okay, let's move over to Cartagena. Power outages are scheduled for Tuesday, December 3rd, 2024. Afinia will conduct electrical infrastructure upgrades in Cartagena, causing power outages in several neighborhoods. Affected areas included Arsenal Street, Callejon Vargas Street, Casalito Street, then that's from 6 a.m. to 3 p.m. La India Urbanización, that's 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. El Pozón Sector, 1, 10 p.m. to 3 p.m. Tierra Bomba Island, Boca Chica District, 7.30 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. La Sevilla Urbanización, La Calina Estates, Estanzuela, 7.30 a.m. to 3.30 p.m. For assistance, contact Afinia via their hotlines or the Afinia mobile app, if you have one. Okay, in gastronomy, Chef Casa Molina guides us through Medellin's vibrant food scene, highlighting both traditional and international cuisines. From bohemian cafes like Salon Malaga to upscale spots like Lucio and Carmen, there's always something for every palate. Don't miss the street food in downtown Medellin or the exquisite dishes at Etrerieles, a historical gem. The region's culinary diversity from local favorites to world-class restaurants make it a must-visit for food lovers. Enjoy the rich flavors and warm hospitality that define this Colombian paradise. Okay, to wrap it up today, in Colombian tourism news, Colombia has unveiled an innovative tourism campaign at the Exosphere in Las Vegas, showcasing the country's beauty and biodiversity. The Columbia Country of Beauty campaign features migratory birds guiding viewers through iconic destinations like Tarona and Cartagena. Displayed on the world's largest LED screen, the campaign aims to attract international tourists and promote sustainable tourism. Running until December 1st, it includes special travel offers and collaborations with influencers to highlight Colombia's unique 
experiences. There you go. So I'm, we just missed that. I'm headed out in a week or less than a week now. I'll be in Las Vegas and I've always wanted to go. Well, always in the past year since it opened, always wanted to go to uh, the uh, sphere. Uh, hopefully I'll get in this time. But let me end it on one last thing. And that is what the COP is versus the USD. Today it is 4390. 4390 COP versus the USD. You are up to date with the latest news out of Medellin, Colombia and Colombia as a whole. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to travel, but travel safe. Yo, it's DC Raw, peep the stream, daily dose. East Coast swagger, hit you with that travel pros. Columbia trips, Medellin tips on the real. Stay safe, stay aware, what's the deal? News on lock, know the blocks before you walk. Stick to the tours, avoid that shady talk. Urban jungle, Vox for miles, it's hot. Keep your eyes and ears open, dots to connect the plot. For your journey, pack your mind, strap it tight. Travel safe insurance, just in case, day or night. Rob's the plug, got the news tips. Medellin's your oyster, just stay wise to stay alive Link up or sink, use the wisdom, that's your shield Guided tours, soak the culture, streets revealed Wondrous spots, safe zones, that's the key DC Rob's the name, bringing you the clarity Roll smart, roll deep with that travel wisdom Medellin's a charm, minus the hazards that glisten Follow the guide, navigate the pave DC Rob, for your peace, make that trip safe Hit the airport, got the passport stamped clean Dream destination, life of vibrancy Cautious moves, it's your cruise, play your part, DC Rob coming through.